All right, I'm back. Make sure you guys press the like button. Okay, so I was looking around on Drip X and I noticed that there's an extra tab called Look Up. <laughs> so let's dive into it and see what it's about. From what I've from what I've experienced, you can enter in a numerical value, press Look Up, and it's going to look up the miner. So if you wanted to either look up your own miners or look up potentially other miners that are out there or even someone else's miner, you can enter in, I don't know, a number and press, you actually got to press the thing. And as you can see, you can name them, which I keep forgetting about that, but it'll show the period, the power, the estimate, uh, the amount of drip. Uh, D rate bonus, cost, market value, ROI, blah, blah, blah. Let's go out for uh, a larger amount. Like, let's just say 100. Because I, the reason why is because I don't want to look up something that has a negative. Dang, that still got a negative. Let's look, <laughs> let's look up 300. D rate. Matter of fact, I'm bugging. Let's look up, uh, let's look up like 3,000. Let's look up 30,000. All these mugs got negative. All right, all right, we're done with that. Um, so basically, as you, this one, one good thing I can see about this is you can see what's profitable based on, okay, so dang, this one is uh, doing pretty good. But let's see where we're at because that's 50, that's 50. So yeah, that's basically almost maxed out from this point the maximum maximum amount of days uh you know in, in which you can kind of move this and see as well like that one was like 130 130ish 130 so you can do like 99 days at full power and kind of get something like that or let me see i guess yeah this one go, uh if you go longer or farther out your ROI is going to be crazier no matter where your power is at, basically. Uh, it's going to be whatever that static amount is. And then this value will change right here, depending on how many days. So that's cool. So shouts out to the team still implementing things. Uh, I know people are going to be complaining in the comment section, as they normally do. And the price of Drip X is, here's the straight up bottom right here. I'm glad I didn't do that trade. I think around this area. I'm like, yo, this is the this is the bottom. This has been the bottom. It, it would have went down here. And I would have been sitting here waiting for it to go back up. But if you if you took a trade all the way, let me see if that thing is on the screen, dude. That's gonna be annoying. Okay, it's not. Cool. I got like pop-ups and stuff from uh some nonsense. Um but if you, if you got in down here or even probably right here or, you know, it might come back down. But at least, you know, this might be the bottom. So if it does c come down here, you can take a trade here and, and and maybe sell back up here from this point to that point. Because uh, me at the at this point in the project, that's basically what I'm looking forward to is taking like little trades like that here and there. Uh, That's I think that's it. I don't have any new miners or any new. I didn't add anything to my. I uh, hope y'all don't see that, man. Something keep popping up on the screen. Ooh. I didn't add any any new uh, shares to my stake because of the whole. I think if I were to do it now, I wouldn't be fighting with the dilution or whatever. But. That's what I said last time, and it seems like people are just jumping in right after. So, you just really never know. Uh, if that did happen, I'll be still it'd be a good thing if I were to get like five hundred dollars worth of uh, drip X and then stake it in here. That should dramatically impact my share rate in, in a positive way, and then we'll see if uh, people start coming in with 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 miners or whatever. But if they do, then that's just going to add to the payout cycles or whatever so yeah man let me know what you guys are thinking uh just check and see if everything else 
Yeah, and I like I told you guys when I first started the series, I wasn't going to be making endless videos day by day if there's nothing to talk about. If there's something to talk about, I'll make a video. If there's nothing to talk, if there's nothing to talk about, I will not make a video. <laughs> uh, or I'll make a video on something else. But as of right now, um, I'm not jumping in too many things because I, I got some other behind the scenes projects I'm working on. And that whole bear chain thing, I, the reason why I didn't make a video on that is because these dudes want you to sign some privacy policy nonsense. I'm like, yo, if that's how y'all want to get down, y'all should have just told us that from day one. Because I want to I wanna waste my time. Not with a crypto project. Even though somebody might say, well, that doesn't mean they're going to do this. That doesn't mean they're going to do that. If they want to find you, they can do this and that. You, you know, the, the typical thing a robot will say, they're going to say it. Um... It's just the principles. Like, I'm not hopping in crypto projects to sign poli privacy policies. I'm not doing that. You can do that. I'm not doing that. So since we know that we're on different pages, you, you don't even have to have to. You don't even have to waste your time to post a comment like that. We are grown men that decide to do different things. Another grown man shouldn't be con that concerned on what another grown man does that's outside of his, you know, his household, his family, or whatever. You know, because some dudes just be trying to... Man, never mind. So, with that being said, make sure you guys hit the like button. That's the reason why I didn't do the... Uh, I discontinued my my participation with the bear chain thing. And if that's what all of... If that's what everybody's about to start doing, then hey, maybe crypto regulations is, is on its way, which I'm still going to benefit from that because of... Uh, I choose to park capital and... and and utility and real world asset cryptos. That's basically where my focus is. So if they if that's how they want to get down, then I guess we're just gonna be getting down uh, like that on the back end. So when that when the policy start coming, I'm not the I'm not the guy that says every all ninety nine percent of stuff is gonna go away. But if it does, then I would say diversify into crypto assets that have real world utility. Um, and, and compliant with certain, you know, guidelines. I'll just say that. And of course, I'm not telling you to do anything. That's not financial advice. That's just what I'm doing. All right. Uh, with that being said, make sure you guys hit the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe to the like button and subscribe to that bell. This is Icy and I'll see you guys on the next video.